Hi, welcome to this week's Living Chaotically. First, we're going to talk a little bit about some breaking news, and then we're going to interview Bo Palin, who was just voted the Yale football captain for next year. We're going to talk to him a little bit about football, and then find out who Bo is underneath the pads. Yeah. All right, so breaking news. Everyone already knows this, but we have a remake of Boy Meets World coming out. It's called Girl Meets World. Corey and Topanga are obviously married, and they have a little hoo-ha. Hoo-ha. <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> <Don't play. laughs> anyway, the two stars just signed on yesterday, so they're definitely in it, which is really exciting for all the fans. And this brings us to our newest segment called Questions with Jeff, Chloe, and Nick. So guys, do we think that Girl Meets World will be good, as good as Boy Meets World? Are we also going to have a crush on Topanga? Will Corey and Topanga get it on? But here's a real question, what would Topanga name her daughter? Topanga Dwa. Topanga Dwa. I think that's it. What about Sean? Little D. Little Could D. he be a cop? He would get arrested too much, I think. Uh, could Sean get away from the cops? He seems like a pretty fit guy. Do cops even need to be in shape? Yeah, I think they eat donuts all the time. The best cops in the world are the one on horses. But the cops on horses, do they, do they have to clean up the horse's shit? Poop. Sorry, poop. Where does that, what do they do with the poop? Because dogs, if you're walking your dog, you, don't you have need to clean a plastic up bag. <laughs> that makes no sense. You don't have to clean Why up the Why don't we have Just horse you have to... cops to yell? That's the Especially because he is so worried about how it looks. That's why New York City has, has horse cops, because it looks nice. We have library security, but we don't have horse cops. <laughs> why do we need library security? Who's stealing books from the library? Who's going to the library? There's a there's this, a buzzer there that'll go off. It'll be like, mm. Have you ever seen people make the out The sacks? No. Oh my god. Away from questions. There was a couple studying snuggling. I was like, whoa, get a room. Like, I'm trying to do my work here. I don't need to be like annoyed and distracted by like the fact that you're cuddling and I don't have a boyfriend, but I don't want a boyfriend. I love cuddling. But I don't have a boyfriend. How does it feel having a girlfriend? How does it like to have neighbors? How does it feel to have a neighbor your whole What's life? What's it like to run through the weed fields at sunset? It's ticklish if you feel the right shorts on. Would you get married tomorrow if you could? Absolutely. I would have got, I would have gotten married two years ago. Why wouldn't have you? Because I would never want to get married. Let's get to Bo. Yeah, let's get to Bo. Let's get to Bo. Yoder. Yoder. Let's start with Bo Kalen, the new captain of the Yale football team. We're going to learn a little bit about him. Well, for starters, he's a Virgo. So if you're a match for that, look him up on Facebook. Um, secondly, so Bo, tell us a little about like what college you're in, what your major is. Jonathan Edwards, junior, class of 2014. Um, hometown is Oconomowoc, Wisconsin. Say that again, please. Oconomowoc, Wisconsin, uh, the greatest state there is. Uh, major is evolution, ecology and evolutionary biology. How do you spell Bo? Bo, B-E-A-U, means handsome in French. Bo, so you, with your major, what do you hope to do after college? Um, well, I'm doing all the pre-med requirements, so, you know. So, doctor? Yeah, fingers crossed, I pass all my classes. Dr. Palin. Bo, um, tell us a little bit about the football field. You're obviously the captain now. Um, for those fans out there who can't tell the difference between a quarterback and a cornerback, tell them a little bit about what you do on the football field, playing, playing defensive line. Explain that for us. Well, I was a tight end. Uh, switched to defense this year. Love defense. I'm a D lineman. And so, you know, for those who don't know football very well, D lineman, you know, some, some of the greats are, um, you know, Clay Matthews is a good He's pass behind rusher. us. He has a little... Uh, Poster. You know, you the can see Nick Daffy and Chris Dooley. Some Nick Daffy with his great there. interception, Harvard Yale, beauty. Yeah, so uh, some some of those great great players. Can you talk um, a little bit about your stats this year? Do you know your stats, Bo? Do you know your uh, stats? So wait, sticking with football, no, like with people on the team, who has the best body? I know you guys see each other right. naked. Best All body. Right. All right. What kind of body are you looking for? You know, girls looking for different things. <laughs> Uh, okay. There's skinny. There's a skinny type. Not not okay. Not skinny fat. Just like big. Built but tight. I mean, best body probably have to go with Other Tom Bib. There it is. Yeah, he's cut. Um. All okay, right. What about best dancer? <laughs> dancer. Go to Dion Randall. Okay. Yeah, Dion. He's trying to teach me a couple things. All right. I'll what sing a what music do you guys? Yeah. 
What music do you guys listen before you? Well, when the, when the stupid old line you can control the iPod, it's all this techno stuff. Um, a lot of house music. A lot of house music, which I'm not about, you know, right after practice or right before it. Yeah, I mean, what about what's on the yeah, what's like, your uh, favorite? I like artists, you know, not necessarily genres. So I'm a big fan of Alicia Keys, I like Colby Calais, Tupac. Um, I like Alison Krauss. It's kind of, you know, she's a little softer, but I can get into it. Kind of all over. Okay, so if you could do M &M. 10 words to describe Bo, what would you do? Um, on or, well, mo off the field. Bo off the field. Underneath the pads. Underneath the pads, exactly. Underneath the pads? Yeah, Bo. Um, smooth skin. <laughs> two. That's, uh. Yeah, that's two. Is it yeah. just underneath the pads? Like, no, it doesn't no, have to be no. physical. Tell it's us like about who you. Who are you, are you Bo? Who's in who, your heart? For all the people out there that haven't got yeah. a chance to meet Bo Pan, yeah. tell them who you are. Who is leading the team to man. victory? I'd say, you know, swoop skin, that's two, right? Yeah, that's, that's two. two words. Uh, better athlete than Dylan Drake. Better <laughs> athlete than Dylan Drake. That's, okay, we're at seven. We just need three more. All right, so driven, relationship-oriented. Driven, relationship-oriented. Playful. 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 Okay. <laughs> So you, well, you mentioned being driven. So can we talk about like any ideas that you kind of have going forward to drive the team forward? Or what, what do you think you can do to yeah, help your so record out, next From year? outside looking in, you know, a two and eight season and this season was forgettable and bad, but that's not really what we believe on the team. You know, seniors like Nick Daffin, uh, Come here. with the blood, sweat and tears out and established a process for us to move forward and take the next step on. So we appreciate what they did and what we did this year as part of the team. Um, but, you know, we're definitely ready to make the next step. And we're going to be working out, you know, every morning at 6 a.m. We're going to be getting some good binding in during that. Um, I know last year you guys went then, paintballing. Yeah, we went paintballing last year. Are you going to do that year. again? Hopefully. That was fun. Um, I'm going to wear a cut this time. <laughs> uh, good to know. Um, In case you're wondering. Wear a cup when you but play paint. Gentleman Crystal okay. gave us a speech last spring, and he's taking us to Gettysburg. Oh, cool! Which is going to be awesome. Yeah. That's for, for people who don't know, who's the gen general? Gentleman Crystal. General. He's a, Crystal. a retired uh, general of the army. Uh -huh. and, you know, very decorated. He teaches the class at Yale, but he's an amazing man, a role model. So. Does he cool also does he coach at all, or is he no, just he more like coach. inspiration? He's just been it stopped. By practice once and then spoke to the team once in the spring. Before the game, he talked to him. And before the game. Which was awesome. So. Most people obviously don't see you guys out there in the mornings and um, at 6 a.m. and stuff like that. So uh, I'm just kind of curious how many people have thrown up so far. Yeah, um, you know, too many to count. But, uh, really? As Muhammad Ali said, Two days in. you can't start counting until it hurts because that's when it counts. Right? So, you know, that's what we're going by. That's awesome. And. So far, the team is working hard. Hopefully, as an alum, Nick and I will come back and we'll beat Harvard Absolutely. next year. Beat everybody next and, year. Yeah, well, everyone. And Princeton in every game. But So, <laughs> before we're totally gone, we're going to get into a look at Bo's room. Uh, it's kind of tight in here, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's small. <laughs> Gabe got my protein. Essential. Got my grandpa's stamp of approval. Old re uh, climbing glasses. Pictures of the family and whatnot. Yeah, let's get some pictures of the family. SAS survival guide and about pararescue, Air Force pararescue, badasses. Got my tools. A good Midwestern man. What is with the Asian sheets? Whoa. Are these silk? Oh, yeah. Silk. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Chinese silk. My mom went to China and got some cheap, cheap silk out there. No so. way. My brother went to Argentina and gave me some I think some boleros. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> what is, what, are they, you, what are you? Do they protect you from vampires? No. Argentinian cowboys would uh This is such a wasted area. Rope the the, the feet, feet of cattle. Yeah. By them. So I figured it you know could come in handy. I feel like what it could protect you to from vampires. I guess no. these look like, like garlic. These are, I think these are balls. Oh. Hmm. Pretty sure. Number 45. 40. 40. Sarbo, <laughs> Alan, Alan, Ben. They're 40. not even the same race. Never.